Hello, um, I'm going to do a review of the uh, MindWave, the NeuralSky MindWave Mobile 2. I've had it for a few months now and, and I thought it'd be time for me to uh, let you know what I think about it. Um, to start with, it's in a really nice secure box. Uh, it's got a lot of foam padding around it and stuff. Um, so, as far as that goes, that's really pretty nice. <clears throat> and uh, here is the uh, MindWave Mobile 2. The biggest difference between the 2 and the 1 is right here. Um, the uh, 2 only has an on-off button. I don't know, can you see that? Uh, the 1 had a pairing uh, button on here so it'd be off on and then pair you'd hold it into pair for about two or three seconds and it would pair uh, this one automatically pairs which I like that um, you don't have to worry about it the only thing I don't like about it is when you don't really know for sure when it pairs you know until you start using the device the other thing is uh, this here is really adjustable you know it, it turns Pretty easily to uh, really adjust your head and of course you know the up down motion uh, and then of course it's got the clip which the uh, uh, neural sky mind wave uh, mobile has um, it fits pretty good I mean like I said it's got some pretty good adjustments on it so you know it does fit on here pretty good um, so I have no problem with that. Of course, I don't like the ear clip, but <clears throat> you know, you got to have it. Um, the uh, other thing I like about this is they have some extra uh, games and app the apps that you can use on this uh, to uh, go with it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you that here in just a moment. I uh, just thought I'd let you know about the unboxing of it, let you know the general idea of it and now to go on to show you some of the stuff that it does here's one of the games it's a uh, neural boy <clears throat> um, the first thing you notice up here is you it's got the headset status um, it lets you know like for instance if I uh, adjust that a little bit to where it's not uh, reading correctly you see how it goes uh, see here the head st status. So it always lets you know what the status is. Now I'll go ahead and, and uh, you saw that because I took it off. Let's see. So now I'm going to go ahead and put it back on. Okay. <clears throat> okay, you can see here the headset status. Connect has got five bars. So I'll go ahead and hit enter the arena. <clears throat> Click any mouse button to start playing. So uh, here, like for instance, the horseshoe button over there, that'll draw anything to you. The pow down here. That makes things explode. The feather, that makes things uh, lift. And this here, fire, makes things uh, catch fire. So we'll start with the magnetic thing. Click on that. And then here I am. So like for instance, I'll go like that. And you can see in this case, it's concentration. The more I concentrate, the more this is going to be drawn to me. You can see here that I'm concentrating quite a bit. If this was down here, it wouldn't be able to draw to me. Like here I am talking to you, so I'm not concentrating enough. So it's going away from me now. I'm concentrating. <clears throat> okay, pow. Okay, again, that's to make things explode. 
Okay, so again. Okay, again with the pallet's concentration, so. Uh, Okay, that's a good little distance. Okay, pal. Okay, and then yeah, I think here. Concentrate. There's another ball here somewhere too. Oh yeah, here, okay. Hmm. Okay, so here's the feather part. Now this is meditate here. See here, you can see down here. So the same thing, uh, the, this is to, supposed to lift it when I meditate. Meditate, meditate. See, and you can see here, I gotta meditate a little more. Come on. Uh, did you see that? That was me meditating, and, and of course, alright, so let's see about the catching things on fire thing here. This is concentrate. 